Welcome back to the Midnight Who Show, and tonight I'm going to be reviewing the season finale of My Adventures with Superman, Hearts of the Fathers, and the two-part episode, Zero Day. And what a phenomenal conclusion to an already great season of television. This is a phenomenal show, and I cannot wait for the second season, which is already in production. I'm so glad they confirmed that, we don't have to wait too long uh, for that announcement. Uh, but Zero Day was a really great two-parter, and I think it did a really great job at wrapping up all of these kind of villains that we were introduced to throughout the season, and where they were leading to with, of course, Task Force X, and General using them to basically go after Superman, and so they can capture him. And that was a brutal fight. I really enjoyed it. You just really see how much more powerful they really are as a team against Superman, and he has a hard time defeating them. But in this first part of Zero Day, I really did enjoy how it touched upon how much destruction Superman can do and how that can create a negative perception with the citizens of Metropolis. I really like that parallel with, of course, the girl he saved and how happy she was when that happened. But then when she saw the destruction and that face change and Superman realizes it. This episode also deals with, of course, for Lois and soon Jimmy, what they reveal from the episode with Mr. Mixaplick about all the evil Supermen in the multiverse. But that's not their Clark. And But the General in Task Force X doesn't think that because they witness Zero Day. And luckily in this episode, we finally get to see what they're trying to stop. And we get to see the earlier invasion of, or at least attempt, by the Kryptonians led by Zod. And it was a great little flashback, and we get to really see where the hatred that the General has comes from. And this episode had a really great, in the second part, with the Parasite, and how much it has now impacted Ivo, and with the electricity, they get bigger and stronger, and it's this giant kaiju in Metropolis. And it's a tough one for Superman to fight. And I really enjoyed how Lois was that inspirational voice to all of Metropolis to tell them to reduce their power. Let's cut this off. And it does help defeat Ivo, even though now there's a giant version of it in Metropolis. But it was a great episode. And now, of course, the General's plan did not go to plan, but he has to now be ordered by Amanda Waller to stop Superman, which comes to fruition in Hearts of the Fathers, which is a really thanksgiving type episode and it does a really great job at balancing the meet your parents versus the final fight of the season and leading into the next and that was a great reveal i knew it was coming they mentioned it as sam in the previous episode but yes the general is lois's father that was a great reveal i really enjoyed it and wow <laughs> poor superman poor clark you know he just wanted to meet Lois's father. He was not expecting that. But this was a great episode, and we get to see the oncoming invasion and how Superman stops it and really kind of makes the general, I think, think a little bit. But he still is ordered by Amanda Waller. But it was a great final battle, and I really enjoyed the effect of Kryptonite in the season. It not just weakens Superman, but we get to see all the veins and this crystallized Kryptonite come out of him. What a powerful thing. And, you know, this episode really made, you know, Superman question why he was sent to Earth in the very first place. But this was a great three episodes. What did you guys think of it? Let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, everyone.